Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Cerberus J Stone here, and today we're gonna be playing some more FTL Advanced Edition. Now, we're gonna be starting a new game, and again, we're still stuck on the Castro. I do have other ships, but those are from previous playthroughs that you haven't seen, and I am still trying to do this because I just keep getting the worst luck. So, we're gonna be hitting start again, and Let's just um, move on. So, we're going to be saving our stations. Everything's all ready. Changing the power. Good. Now we're going to be jumping. Now, there's a lot of nebulas here that I would like to try and take advantage of. So, I'm going to go up and we're going to see what we face. And, of course, it is a scout. Oh, no. Please do not get the weapons. No, you're going to get the engines. Not much better, and I have something wrong with my shield, so... This sucks. Mind you, the shields don't even matter because that's going to just go right through them. However, it would have been nice to be have, have the ability to maybe dodge that. But here we go. Missile away. Oh, there go the uh, doors. That's fine. The doors can go down. That is perfectly okay. I will deal with no doors. What I can't deal with, though, is no pilot. Yes, I can. I can deal with no pilot. We're just going to be shooting our burst laser here because the ion cannon isn't going to do anything. Oh, no. Our hack systems, which are now disabled. Okay. Now you're just, you know, beating a dead horse here. Not beating a dead horse. What is it? Just kicking me while I'm down? That's it. I almost don't want to use any missiles because I don't want to replace them because I be cheap. Now since the shield's down, I'm gonna... Oh. Oh boy. Not the ion cannon. This is terrible. Oh, my doors are, dis are disabled. The ship explodes. Leave behind a collection of youthful... Yeah. I got a dry mouth, excuse me. <clears throat> <clears throat> Nondescript liquid. We're gonna be continuing on and we're gonna be making our way eventually to the nebula, but we're gonna go all the way to the top and see what's, oh great, a sun. Oh my goodness, and what? This is great luck. I am glad this is happening right now. This is great. Glad this is my life. Alright, so. We're just gonna fight each other, I suppose. Heal. Go back. Uh, we need to take out that mind control. Okay, now, both of you, go heal up after punching the crap out of each other. And I did not actually save you to anything, so you're going there, and you're going there, I guess. Save the stations. Uh, oh, nope, nope. Uh, we're gonna be shooting that. You're down. And I'm gonna be set on fire. Great. I did get a bunch of scrap though, so that's gonna be useful. Oh no, not the engine room. Every time. Why is, why is the whole universe obsessed with my engine room? Like it's being hacked. It's being stunned while being hacked. It's being shot at. And now this, the universe itself is conspiring against me by solar flaring into my engine room. Now there's coincidence and there's uh, conspiracy. And you know what I smell? A long string of coincidences. This is a roguelike. It appears a distress beacon is coming from the surface of a nearby moon. Hmm. We're picking up a single life form. Eh, this is early. Let's go down. You find a colony that seems to be recently attacked. Exploring the devastation, you find a lone survivor. Right, invite him to join our crew. He states that he was an engineer before he was stranded. Ooh. He happily offers his services for a time in exchange for getting off that rock. Ah, cool. And it's a mantis. Now, I'm going to put you in the engine room because you're like a really early buff. So... Now, Tack is going to be in technology. <laughs> yeah, what a terrible joke. He's going to be in shields, and he's going to be saved there. Now, what would be really cool is to take advantage of this and then find a store, but 
I think we're going to take our chances and hit this one, this one, this one. This, yeah. We're hitting all the nebulas. It's going to be scary because the nebulas can bring plasma storms and plasma storms stuck. Stuck. You've jumped into the aftermath of what seems to have been a brutal exchange between several ships. Wreckage drifts by your screens and you can still see the remains of the dying ships, sparking and breaking apart. It's hard to, to determine who the combatants, combatants were without close investigation. Investigate the battlefield. As you approach the wreckage, a mantis ship screams into the system. Either something to pray or to finish the job. Its fellows start it? Okay. So, we're going to be launching immediately weapons and they're not going to be teleporting over, which is nice. So, let's hope these land... Yes, now they are defenseless. I am not going to use any more missiles. I might use a missile. I might. Okay, no, I don't need to use a missile. May You're playing guess who is my heart here, ship. I just need to take it down before it shoots. Yes, I did it. <laughs> First try. The ship explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap. Yes, and two missiles. So... I used one, but I gained another. That's a plus in case you needed help with basic math. Cause sometimes I do, so I'm here to offer my services when I can. I kind of want stronger doors. I feel like that'd be useful, but so would piloting. I think it's worth getting a permanent buff, buff for the autopilot because it could come in handy later. So now we have a permanent full power. Hopefully all of it doesn't be taken away by plasma storms. Your crew are constantly looking out the windows, checking for hostiles. They jump at every creak and moan of the ship. The tension is almost palpable, but no action. More nebula. <coughs> Excuse me. You see a small station nearby and a, uh -oh, feel a shudder of shots ringing through the ship. You can't be sure without sensors, but it seems there may be intruders on the ship. Oh, Siri, where are the intruders? We need better doors. Oh, doors active. Wait. This is going to be an easy fight. Oh boy. And I lost uh, that. Okay. in here and fight now before everyone dies please before everyone dies please oh my god oh my god okay good uh everyone over here now but i mean everyone oh wait uh i need you two to actually fix things and i only need you to go in there okay there we go things will be okay we are going to survive Please survive. We need more oxygen, guys. There we go. I'm glad everyone's on the same page. Now, go to your stations. Close doors. And I'm just going to wait for that to go up for a little bit. Take a drink. Sorry guys, I just realized that I could mute and unmute, so now you won't hear unnecessary slurping noises. Learning from my mistakes. Now, going to the next nebula, I kind of want one more power bar just in case. Can't use it for much. Maybe I should put it on engines. Or save it to buy something. Let's save it to buy something. I'm going to regret this, aren't I? Nope, no plasma storm. A heavily damaged Federation ship is hiding at, in the nebula at this beacon. Before you have time to make contact with them, they fade into the nebula. Attempt to follow and help them. Your search is hopeless. Your sensors can't pick up anything in the nebula. Well, I got garbage sensors, so yeah. 
Ooh, a store. It's a good thing I didn't spend my money. So I can jump here, 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 and then be right back on track. Or just go here. Let's just go here. Be dangerous. There are only two ships within range, and they seem to be uh, engaged in battle. One of them has the markings of a space pirate. Aid the civilian ship. You power up your weapons and engage the pirate ship. Alright. Standard procedure. Take out the weapons. We're gonna see how this goes. Fire. Weapons down. Now, we're going to take off our missile launcher because I only got seven missiles and I hate replacing them. And there's a store nearby, so I think it's more important to take out the pilot. And then go for the weapons again, because I don't mind being shot once, but twice? Not cool, bro. Ha, you missed. The pirate ship breaks apart. You hasten to contact the civilian ship. Nice, we got three fuel and a missile that we used. Good. Ooh, nice. The sector has become increasingly dangerous for friends of the Federation. I think my crew can patch up some of your hull damages, thanks. And five damage repair, nice. I got all my health back. That was so worth it. Now I don't need to pay for uh, any repairs. So, one reason to go to the store, negated. A transmission from the nearby planet indicates an outpost below which offers supplies to travelers. You send out an away party to check it out. Alright, so. I uh, can't buy anything. So, I guess missiles. Fuel. And that's it. Alright. What a useful store jump. Alright. Ah. Stumble across an enemy, but they're trying to flee. I'm gonna take out their engine. Wait, what is this? What is that? Hold on a minute. What is this? Anti combat drone. Oh, okay, so that's fine. So it won't shoot down my, uh, my missiles. So Artemis, fire. And miss. Alright, cool. Let's try that again. Don't want to waste the missile, but we're going to do it. There we go. That. Oh, I just shot its drone. Nice. Um, I guess we need to concentrate fire on that so they stop charging. And I'm going to save the missile until I desperately need it. Come on, burst laser. Come on, burst laser. Okay, Artemis, I need you to do something deadly. Yes. Not good. Um, so, it turns out you're going there now. And you are going to fire on that now. Alright. Glad that's been decided. Alright, so, not bad. Come on. No! Ah, not cool. Oh, that is close. Oh my gosh, that is close. We're going to jump. We're gonna survive. Oh no, not a plasma storm. Great. We arrive in a plasma storm. Despite the harsh conditions, a rebel scout scene has been waiting for me. Cool. Like, that's just awesome. <sighs> okay. I think I just need to get out of here as fast as possible. I'm going to be losing oxygen fast. I just need to hurt him and run away. Okay. That's what's going to happen now. Please heal faster. There we go. You need to go back to weapons. Then you need to go back to the shields. Alright. Not good. Come on. All right, weapons are down. Now, we need to leave. Or win this fight. Okay, now I'm now I'm tasting blood and I need to go for it. <clears throat> but I'm still going to be charging. So now I'm going uh all out. I need this to land. 
Okay, good. Oh, I should uh, put air into the ship. That would be nice. I'm sure people would appreciate that a lot. I don't know what drone's supposed to be here, but I'm just gonna keep launching bullets. Lasers. Lasers. Yeah. Now I can't run away. I'm gonna not use any more missiles, though. I think... I think... I think missiles are for chumps. But, uh, shields are pretty cool. So, we're gonna just, uh, turn on the shields for a minute. Like, one hot minute here until we blast away all those weapons. Yeah! Alright. Back to charging. I think I'm just gonna keep shooting at the weapons. Or anywhere. I'm gonna shoot anywhere I want because it has one health. Oh, yeah. Ship down. The ship explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap material. No missiles, though. That's a... Oh, my God. Okay, wait. Hold on a minute. Uh, ha, ha. Um, I don't need murder. Uh, I need that and that and that. Okay. I'm happy about that. We're going to sit here just for a minute because I almost asphyxiated my entire crew sure they appreciated that so once we hit about 75 no about 80 percent then i'll jump us so just one second okay there we go i think we should just leave but i really want to push my luck so that's what i'm gonna do oh my goodness a pirate ship is lying in wait inside this asteroid field. It immediately moves into attack. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Bing. Dare. And dare. Okay. I hope this works. I don't want to die. Shield dude is going to be working overtime. Come on, tack. Oh, nice. Oh, they're done. So now I don't need to worry about being shot at. I'm just gonna try and take out their shield and then let the universe do the work. Yeah. Oh, they offer me one missile. Hmm. I don't want a drone part, so I'm not gonna accept. I'm just gonna wait for you to perish in like two asteroid hits. Or me, if the asteroids decide to not come. Hmm. There we go. There we go. The ship explodes, giving me two missiles and two fuel. Things I could actually use. Good. It was totally worth destroying those defenseless people. Alright. Got away with it. I hope. You arrive at the Long Range Beacon. When the FDL drive is charged, you can jump to the next sector. You are immediately hailed by a mobile docking platform upon arrival. Welcome to Uncle Joe's Fix-It Shop. Need a tune-up? We got you covered. Inquire, uh, oxygen system... Uh, yeah, why not? Let's upgrade our oxygen system. But how? Cool. Now I got double oxygen. That's pretty cool. Um, pirate. We're going to the pirate controlled. I want to fight. If the reports are true, this area has been under the control of pirates for quite some time. Some traders still attempt to trade with the few settlements that remain. But they do so at great risk. All right, we're gonna be jumping. All right, wait, how do we? Hmm, I don't think we're gonna be hitting the nebulas this one. I feel like we're gonna try and see how many different options we can actually take here. We gotta either go all up this way or stick down here and hit all these guys, so. And let's go up. I can still back out if I want to. Oh no. A small research station or orbits a nearby pulsar. It appears largely abandoned, but detect power signatures flaring up as soon as you're in scanning distance. A small combat combat ship launches from the station. Pirates! Uh, we're gonna be taking out the pathetic weapons. Okay, maybe I shouldn't uh do it on that. Maybe I should do it on the... Wait. I don't want to do it yet. See what happens. Okay. I'm glad I totally waited for that. Alright. Uh, let's 
have some help preparing, and we're gonna be shooting those weapons right now. Enough of that. Uh, that's that's cute. Well, uh, they're only ion pulses, right? Like, okay. Let's keep shooting that now. Uh, great. Um. Oh boy. Not fun. Uh. <clears throat> I hope that doesn't land. Oh, thank goodness. All right. Uh, take that out, please. I'm tired of that being there. Oh boy. Oh, this is an embarrassingly hard fight. Okay. Alright. Uh yeah, keep shooting. Keep keep shooting it. Yes. Yes, yes, just accept the offer. I'm tired of fighting. Oh my god. Alright. Just keep on the stunning. I don't mind the stuns. I can deal with that. Oh my goodness. Yes, another ion stun. Uh, I'm just gonna wait for that to die out before I jump. No, oh, I can't even jump. I need to wait for it to die out. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Um, okay. Aha! I win. Ooh, uh, let's hit this, 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 yeah. Oh, don't tell me it hit me still. It appears that the distress beacon is coming from the surface of a nearby moon. Your sensors are picking up a single life form. Oh yeah, let's investigate. You find a man living alone in the cave from the appearance of his wrecked ship. It seems he's been here for quite for, for many years. He looks healthy, but his mental state is questionable. Uh, no, I don't think so. Last time that happened, I lost a guy. Not losing a guy. Over some crazy guy. Because the crazy guy will murder my guy. And you once you arrive, your screens light up of, with warnings, and nearby pirates seem to have advanced hacking tools. Oh, and they have tried to shut down your engines. Your crew manages to keep them barely operational. Okay, okay, okay. Good. So... That's cool. Let's uh, take that out now. Let's just see. I don't want to use the missile right away. I'll take the hit. Oh, good. Good. That makes me feel better. But I need to keep on the damage or else that laser will totally get through. Yes. Maybe I'll just keep shooting it because odds are they're still repairing it. Actually, let's see. Who's repairing it? Ooh, two of the rocks, eh? Take them out. Wow. Glad I used that missile. Well, they're gonna go down. Hopefully the next volley. I will take them down. I promise you. <laughs> if only that missile landed. They have surprisingly good dodge. With the pirate ship destroyed, your ship system is restored to full functionality. You salvage what you can from the debris. That's a lot of scrap. Right before the... You know. Right before the store. That is very useful. All right. You receive a wine man automated message. Welcome to our humble trade depot and shipyard. All are welcome and try any funny business and our 152 automated turrets with satellites will tear your ship to shred. Trip? Ship. Aha. Uh -huh. Ooh. Mmm, I want that right away. But the fire beam. Fire beam. Honestly, that is really nice to have sometimes. But. Hmm.
I gotta do it. It's the best thing. And one missile. Nice. Now, the more I put people down, the more I'll have. Soon after arriving in the system, you are hailed by a small cruiser. What good fortune that we happen to run into each other. Nothing personal. But you have some information we need. Oh, I do, do you? Well, I have some la lasers you need. Just uh, never mind. Terrible at this. Your weapons are down. No more weapons. Who's repairing them? Oh my, please shoot, shoot laser, shoot laser. Yes, more damage, more damage. Come on, laser. I kind of want to use that, but the laser will do it. Yeah, laser. The ship explodes. Leave behind a substantial collection. Blah, blah, blah. I'm glad that happened. Go back to your station. Pilot the ship, you lazy pilot. I don't know. Yeah, we'll go to the nebula. Why not? Or we'll go to the asteroid field. A pirate ship was lying in wait inside this asteroid field. It immediately moves into attack. Turn and fight. Uh, yeah, we need that to go down right away. Uh, let's just see what happens here. Oh boy. No, 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 laser. No, oh, okay. Whew. I feel better now. Now the shield. Oh, they were all rocks, okay. Let's just keep on the, uh, yeah. And an asteroid will come and take it out here any second now. Or not. Or not. I, oh, okay. Alright. It worked. It's dead. Glad I was right in the end. Half that asteroid missed because I teleported away. A heavily damaged Federation ship is hiding in the nebula at this beacon. Before you have time to make contact with them, they fade into the nebula. Attempt to follow. While searching fruitlessly through the nebula, you stumble upon a rebel ship which the Federation loyalists were likely hiding from. You prepare for a fight. Oh no, not a enemy combat drone. Alright. Ooh, but the missile... No, this is more important because they could do so much more damage. Alright. Nice. Alright. Ooh, plus. Nice. That's. Ow! Ah, oh, my cat just clawed me right in the freaking leg. Ugh. Alright. Drones are down. Ah, now I'm itchy where I got scratched. Ah. Uh, let's take out the drone very quickly now. Boom. Oh. Well, just keep shooting at the drone, I guess. And it is really helping the shields, and I almost have him at like plus 10 evasion. There it is. Nice. Like that thing is really boosting my uh, my stats. All right, I do not want to be missiled, so let's take out theirs. All right. Uh, all right, you win. Here's some equipment from our stores. Leave us alone. I kind of do want that much fuel. All right, let's go. You did help me get bad ass, so I'll take it. Um, well, what do I want to do? Power. I kind of want to always see what's going on over there, so that's what we will do. Yeah, we're going here. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, we're going all that fun stuff. As soon as you arrive, a small mantis ship detaches from a wreck and jumps away. 
He must have interrupted their salvage operation because they find a weapon ready to be installed. Well, that's pretty lucky. Yeah. Sweet. All right. So, um, that was awesome. Now I just need 10 more points to add a thing. Your crew are constantly looking out the windows, checking for hostiles. They jump at every creak and moan of the ship. The tension is almost palpable. Let's just GTFO, bruh. Oh yeah. Your ship emerges quite far away from the beacon. You see a rebel ship waiting nearby, undoubtedly stationed to look for you. Attack the ship. We're gonna take this guy out. Right here. Right. Eventually. We're gonna do it. It'll happen. Just you wait. It's just... Waiting. Only a couple more. Hmm. Oh my goodness. No. Okay. Uh. Heal. Willow. Go back, Willow. Alright. Alright, let's see how that works. We're gonna be just using the ion uh, blast right now and the burst lasers and hopefully this will actually one more one more volley yes now they shoot even faster more missiles I'll take that because odds are I won't get that many missiles if I myrtleize them if I unalive them say I think I could do this I think hope because, uh, um, wait, you look like a military vessel. We're trying to get back to our homes alive. I'm an engineer by trade, and wow, that's what, no, uh, no, uh, uh, this is, uh, not a good idea. I'm leaving. All right. You arrive at the long range beacon. When the FTL drive is charged, you can jump to the next sector. Have you come across an asteroid mining crop uh, company colony? They message you immediately saying, Greetings! Our supplies of mining explosives have run out ever since the rebels blockaded this system. Do you have any extra explosives? Missile weapon. Offer to solve their problem by launching a missile. Well, I appreciate your enthusiasm. We have certain protocols for the use of explosives around the workplace. Launching a military-grade weapon into our minds isn't exactly what I would call union-friendly. Uh, give them the requested five missiles. Oh, yeah, that's such a... No. Yeah. I understand. Good luck out there. We'll try to make do with what we have. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. You will. You will do that. Yeah. I guess we're gonna go... Let's... Well, easy or rebel. Civilian. I want to take the easy route. All right. Welcome to a new sector. Get to the exit beacon and jump to the new sector before the pursuing rebels catch you. Oh my. It is all nebula. I have a hat and and the only solution is more cowbell. I kind of forget the reference, but the tangled wrecks of many ships await in dormancy here. You see lights flicker on what looks like debris. A rebel scout bursts out of the wreckage. Okay, uh, what are you hack? Okay. Okay, I didn't want to use that anyway. Jerk. That's gonna work. fail, so we're just gonna do that instead. Oh my god. Uh, please take that out now. Oh my god. Thank goodness, those missiles are finally landing. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh.
All right, let's just keep trying for now. My goodness. All right, it's down. I hope that just stays down for now. Ugh. That sucked. Oh my gosh. No. I need to take that thing out. ship explodes uh, geez louise oh no that really sucked that's like literally all my uh, all my freaking Okay, not all my health, like half my health. It sucked, but there's the big stinky butt. Let's just get through this, get to the store, heal that up and move on. It's hard to see why, but this beacon is apparently a tourist destination. One of the ships is, wow. Yes, yes, yeah, trade that. That's awesome. I'll do that any day. <coughs> Excuse me. An advanced rebel automated ship appears. Oh, sorry. Remains stationed near small rebel space station. Sensors indicate it's a storage vessel for military goods. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, I may have been just a wee bit naive. I thought this was a good idea, but I was wrong. Okay. Now, we need to take that out. Actually, no, we need to take this out. Whatever this is, I don't like looking at it. That is very pincery looking. Oh my, that is a very strong laser. That laser is something to be feared. Oh, please hit that thing. That's not enough. Um, that is not enough. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No, terrible. Alright, so this thing is going to blast me in like two seconds with its laser. Okay, great. Just stay down. God damn it. Ion blaster, just keep on the cloak or something. I don't. Oh my god. The burst laser is failing me. The Ion Blast is doing great. Oh boy. Oh great. I'm glad this is happening. Okay. Good. Although it's probably charging right now, so that's doing nothing. Take out the cloak. Ha! That probably did nothing still shoot the ship yeah Ugh. you salvage what you can the station was either abandoned or stripped clean you find nothing very useful no or of use at all probably that's what it said all right uh go back to your station It appears that an automated rebel scout was positioned within the nebula to warn of your passing. The ship starts to power up its FTL drive. If it gets away, it will no doubt warn the fleet of your position. 
Okay, not good. Oh boy. I gotta use it to take out the shields, hopefully. Now, I'm gonna hold on the Ion Blast and the Burst Laser. <coughs> and just hope that the Artemis lands. Okay, good. So now that it didn't land, we're gonna time this. Alright. Alright, I timed it great, but, um, that sucked. Oh my god. I'm glad this is happening right now. Really glad this is happening right now. I'm dead. I'm just fucked. Take me. Take me, world. I can't survive this. What? I... It... It didn't even stick around to watch me die. I can't... Even... I just been snubbed by a scout. I just got my ass handed to me by a scrub ship. Ugh. That's what you get for not upgrading your shields. That's what it was. I just did not upgrade my shield. God, that burns. Man. Ugh. All right. It's fine. It's fine. I'm gonna try again. The data you carry is important. Yes, it totally is. Nebulous. Don't be a plasma storm. Yay. Attack the ship. Oh my goodness, I did not set this up. I am going a little bit too quick, so let's slow down. Boom. We're gonna do this again. Because I love doing it again. Uh oh. Okay. Great. We're gonna take that out now. Yeah, that made me feel better. All right, we don't need that blasting anymore. Just in case, we're gonna open that up. Yeah. I wonder what they're gonna be repairing first. Let's check it out. Nothing, cause we're in a. Nebula, that's right. How naive of me. Let's take out their pilot. Oh, yes, I'll take that. Two missiles. Only used one. Go to the other nebula. Attempt to follow the Federation ship hiding in nebula? Yes. Ah, you get lucky and find them floating not too deep in the nebula. Thrilled to be found by friendlies. They come aboard and abandon their wrecked ship. To cat. The clan. He's a rock boy. They're going into the shields, rock boy. Save. Alright, jump. Um more nebula. I'm having a good feeling about the nebulas, except that when there's nothing in the nebulas. Huh, nebulas. Yes, funny. Haha. <laughs> When the sensor is down, you spend a good deal of time staring out the window. It is, you must admit, you must admit, rather beautiful here. Is that, did I, did, oh, God damn it! Hey, this dress, we'll go here. There's gotta be something here, right? Gotta be some action at the distress. It appears that the distress beacon is coming from the surface of a nearby moon. Your sensors are picking up a single life form. You find a man living alone in a cave, but, but, no, no, bye, man. I'm not losing another ship guy to your rantiness. You stumble across a rebel scout. Oh, they're powering up the FTL. We gotta take them out. Didn't mean for that to rhyme, but I'm happy it did. Alright. What? Okay. Uh. Well, we're fighting now. Hooray. Oh, thank goodness. They did. They kind of missed terribly. Oh, 
Oh wait, don't shoot that. Yeah. Let's try that again. Their ship breaks apart. Yeah. Boom, heal, boom, boom. Jump. Oh, that's the only one that can get there, eh? Well, we're going up here then. Right into the sun. This beacon has been placed too close to a super giant class M star. The ship will gl gradually overheat until you get out of here or die. A pirate, apparently oblivious to the dangers of the sun, moves in to engage. Well, let's blast them out of the sky, shall we? I don't want to be sliced by that laser. We'll just do that. Hopefully it works. Yes. Good. No more missile. Just shoot him with that. You go there. Okay. They be shooting quick. No, okay. All right, heal up Debbie while the rock takes out the fire. All right, now both of you get in there, heal that up. All right. Please get out of here before it Yes. All right. Here we go. You have encountered a refugee ship uh, drifting in space. It looks as if it was fleeing the rebel advance and ran out of fuel. Its distress beacon is active, but you're not sure anyone's on board. Hail them. The vessel is relieved to hear from you. They are running low on supplies, and they suggest a trade. Uh. No. Sorry. Not. Can't risk it. Can't do it. All right. Nothing personnel, kid. That is extremely dangerous. And now... laser all right keep up on the weapon damage there ship yeah oh you're powering up your FTL to escape eh all right you're not uh I'd rather take you alive. Wait. That sounds better, but no. Well, that sounds so dumb. Scrub it is dumb. No one asked you. <laughs> yes, you did. <laughs> what are you doing over there? Oh my god. <laughs> 
he was screwed. That single mantis just like, uh, I'm gonna sit here at the ship and go down with it. Blah. The ship explodes, leaving behind a substantial collection of useful scrap material. Even if I left him alive, he wouldn't have been able to survive. Like, there is no way to get out of there. Like, with all of your limbs. 50 just to get two and then I would need another 40 so literally once I get 90 scrap I can get one more shield all right uh, no we're not gonna pay a toll to pirates we're going to like take another boarding party like this is so oh you picked the wrong person to fight but oh you were stupid for approaching him I need you to put that fire quicker. Fire quicker. Fire quicker. Damn it. Ugh. Alright, um. Oh, I need all the damage to be put out, like, now, I guess. Uh, it seems you. Wow, five fuel. That's just. Ah, uh, but. Take it. Okay. Heal up first. Alright. Yes, I know I'm making him do it all over again, but that's because I'm dumb. Obviously. And not paying attention is another one. Alright. Uh, boom. Jump. You detect a rebel. Attack it to get to the sensor station. Wait, I'm not, I don't need that. Whatever. Take it out. Woo, missed. Blast him. Yeah. Take it out, I'll fight him. Autopilot. Yeah. That's a little bit useless, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> All right. No. Um, we're just gonna go there, but not gonna continue on. We're gonna go with rock control. Yeah, rock. The rock people have a particularly ag aggressive stance toward alien races trespassing in their space. Oh, good. You should tread carefully here. Well, I think I will. So. I think next episode we're gonna start upgrading. Actually, you know what? While we're here, let's just upgrade. Ah. Uh, there. I did it. Now I could have two shield and barely dodge. All right. Well, that's all the upgrading I can do. I have four scrap left, so. I'd like to thank you all for watching me right to the end here. I was a lot more talkative in this episode as per advice given to me. And I hope you all enjoyed it. So again, I'd like to thank you all for joining me for the journey. And if you liked it, be sure to hit like and subscribe and blah, 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 blah. All that fun stuff, which I don't feel right sane. It feels dirty, like something I need to wash off after. In fact, I'm going to in the shower right in a minute. So thank you all for watching and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.